So today I have a pretty large haul from Nasty Gal and I'm so excited because I ordered a bunch of stuff from their new arrivals page, just like the new the new products. I feel like when you guys shop, do you guys shop just like new or do you, you guys ever actually sort? I feel like I'm always, whenever I shop online, I always just go to new arrivals because I want to see what the new arrivals are because they're new and they just arrived and I want to see what those are and then from there I can select like looking for a dress or whatever. I don't know, I've never really like, I don't think I really sort by category unless I'm doing shoes, unless I'm looking specifically for shoes. But anyway, I got a bunch of stuff from their new arrivals and then I got to get my hands on a few pieces from their Cara Delevingne collab. So Cara Delevingne and Nascale have a collab line that collaborated on a line and it is so iconic in like the coolest pieces, amazing quality, like really cool style. I only got to get my hands on three pieces. It's going to sell out really, really quickly. The day you're watching this video actually will be the day that it drops. So if you like anything, I just suggest that you order it. And I'm not just saying that. I'm just giving you a word of the wise because, because Nasty Gale has such great price points and her line is very stylish and trendy. I know that it will sell out quickly. So if you like anything, I just suggest you order it, you know, before it sells out. So without further ado, Let's hop on in. Let's start with the Cara Delevingne pieces. I got, like I said, I got my hands on three of them. First thing I got is this blazer. It's like a little crop blazer. I got a little bit oversized in a size U, um, in a size US 6. Um, I'll put all the sizes down below, the sizes I got, all the pieces, and so I don't have to just mention it throughout the video. If you're interested in whatever size that I got, you can just refer down to the links. Also down below, I will have um, a link to every single piece, so you can click the links down below to purchase anything that you like. That way, make it easy for you. And yeah, just really exciting that I'm getting to partner with Nasty Gale. Nasty Gale has literally been one of my favorite brands ever since it was just first blowing up. Like, literally when Sophia Marusso's Girl Boss book was out, like... Girl, but like I've ordered from Nasty Gale myself so 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 many times, so I'm so excited to be working with Nasty Gale on this video and getting to show you guys all these pieces like literally before anyone else will because the day I'm showing you these is the day that this drops, so you get to see like a first look. So it's really exciting and I'm really happy about it. So yeah, but this is the first crop laser. It's kind of open like this. It's really cute just to throw over something. I think it'd be really nice if you wore like a black lace bra under it and then had it like thrown over with like high waisted jeans or something like that. I think it'd be a nice fun look because it's still, you know, even when it hangs like this, it still hangs pretty closed. Like it's not, um, you know, it's not like it's like open when it's hanging. It's pretty much still like covering your front half. The next piece I got is this top. It's basically like a long, like, I don't even know. I want to say silky, but it's like the coolest material ever. It's like a shimmery kind of like, it's like a black reflective dress shirt material and it's kind of long. So I would probably wear this as like a um, kind of like a t-shirt dress vibe. I think that depending on what size you go, you can definitely wear it like that. This is a size 2, so if you're taller than me and you want to size up a little bit so you can wear it like that, I think this would be so pretty in the fall time like this with, I feel like, like white, like printed leggings or like a, a black kind of cool printed legging would be so pretty. And, boot, and I actually got two pairs of boots from Nasty Gale. I'm pretty sure they're the same ones, but I just got them in two colors because I love them so much. They are these like little latex booties. I love boots that go up like this high. I hate when they cut up like right here. Personally, I just feel like it makes my ankles look weird. Does anyone else feel like that? Like, you know those boots where like they literally like cut off right there and then when the person's walking, it's like the boot is like moving around? That, that just gives me OCD. It just hits me in the wrong way. I don't know why. I don't like it. I like when the, the boot goes high up like this. I find it so much more flattering on your leg. I find it gives like your leg a really nice shape. It doesn't like move around when you're walking. Um, I love these so much. The heel is really cool. It's like uh, really wide and then it has like a from the side it looks like triangular. Like I said, they're like this really nice shimmery latex. They kind of have like a little square toe in the front, which is really trendy. These are so pretty and I could see myself, like I said, wearing this like little silky thing, belted or unbelted, with a cool like printed legging and then these. I feel like that'd be just like such a hot fall look. And where's the last one that I got from the collection with this blast? I already wore this in a video. And I, did, I really wanted to mention it, but I couldn't mention it yet. And this is this like white blouse and it has like it's so cool because in the, in the front it looks like, almost it like looks like a butt, I already wore like I said once, that's why it has a gold mark on it, I need to get it washed and dry clean. In the front it looks like a blazer, it has like these buttons and then it, like these little flaps open and then like the arms have really nice detailing. Um, if you can see it's like a white silky chiffon material but the, that has like very structured, you see how it goes from like in and then it puffs out but here the way it's sewn it's like really structured and it has little, um, things here like that. 
so pretty this top is so elegant beautiful and i've genuinely never seen a blouse like this i can truly say i've never seen a blouse that has like this kind of buttoning with like the o big open kind of like vest chest and then such pretty structured arms like this material is so I just want you to be able to see up close. So silky and nice. Uh, also, I got that same pair of shoes, like I said, in white. I just find that these boots are so stunning and look so, so, so expensive. Another mm -hmm. accessory I got was this little corset tie. So it's kind of like a belt, but to go around your waist. And it ties. It has like these frills. And then it goes around like this. I just find this will be so fun and flattering. Like, I don't know what I'm exactly going to wear it with, but I know that I will need this in my, like, life. I felt like if you're wearing some sort of, something that's really basic, and then to have this kind of, like, the frills and the fun with, to bring cinch your waist, and maybe, like, with a t-shirt dress or a sweater dress or something like that, I just find that'll be really cool to wear. Or even, like, a, with a white kind of, like, cropped tee almost to wear, almost, like, like right here and then have like a white t-shirt i just th thought that this was such a cool again unique piece this little silky piece this is a cheetah like little cheetah blouse and it's like a kind of like a chiffon material like this get a good look at it i like they can show this to you up close so you can kind of see it and then it has this really cool structure around it that gives it like a rounded waist it's kind of like a like kind of like a band I wouldn't say it's a band, it's almost like kind of hard. It has something inside here, okay? We're like, and then it gives you like kind of like a round shape right there. Yes, I got this red turtleneck. I love red. I feel like it's like my power color. Whenever I wear red, I just feel like so like on, like so fiery. Like I just feel so, yeah, I guess like I'm sure all people wear feel powerful and red. It's such a strong, vibrant color. I got this little turtleneck. I think that this would be really good. Um, I feel like I don't need to explain how you can wear a turtleneck. You could literally wear this like in 500,000 ways. Next, I got this really funky dress. I love this dress. It's really interesting because it's not something I'd naturally be drawn to, but something about it, I was like, I love it. It is so funky. Like, I cannot wait to wear it out. I feel like, obviously, in the fall time, deeper tones are in. You know, it's great. We love a good burgundy. This is so fun. Like, the print, like, I can't, the, first of all, the cut of the dress is really flattering like it has you know this has like a thick waist and then it's a mini it's kind of a mini length so like I said it's really flattering on um the print of it is so funky like I don't even know how else to describe it it is so funky and it's a velvet it I feel like this is something you'd find like at a vintage well thrift store is already vintage but like at a thrift store like wearing this with like black leggings and a black boot would be really cool if you really want to be extra I think black leggings and a white boot would be really cool yeah I think that'd be really cool or white leggings and a white boot. this top I wore on Instagram story and everyone panicked over it like I did not think that this would get such a response I wasn't even showcasing the shirt it was a selfie you could see the shirt in my selfie after I went to yoga it is this white t-shirt this is in a size US4 so I, I recommend getting it oh, like a size up or two sizes up that's how I like to wear my tees and just says crystal on it and it has like an amethyst I want to say an aventurine citrine I don't know, this blue one isn't really, like, maybe blue calcite, and then I'm assuming they're trying to go for rose quartz here. But it has just crystals on it, and it's white. I just think it's a really nice basic tee. I like wearing this to my yoga class, and I'm doing, like, uh, one of my specific kinds of yoga, uh, where I like to wear white. Um, I think it's a really cool top just to wear normally. I mean, you could literally wear this. I don't need to explain it, right? It's a graphic tee. Like, why am I explaining it? It's 2019. We get it. Long, maxi, silky dress that has, like, stripes going down. Um, really pretty sleeves. It's like a really, to me, this is like very elegant and sexy. It's almost like mo like mom's night out to me vibes. Like it's like so, it's still, you know, it's long. It's like, it's not like form hugging, right? It has a belt, so you tie to make it form hugging, but it's just so flowy and like long that you're not thinking of it as like a sexy piece immediately, right? But because it's so silky and it has like this really pretty way, like little way the neck opens and then you can cinch it in, it ends up being a really beautiful piece. I think again, this would be really nice with a black boot. I think that like tights are gonna be really cool. I need to order some more black tights. I feel like tights just add such a fun vibe. Like you could wear this with the boots and it'd be fine, but this the black tights under and then the boots, I feel like just add adds like a nice touch to it and then it makes it a bit more of a fall outfit. So, as I said, snakeskin and all types of print is in right now and this is red stains because these are really intense. I wore them really basic. I wore a black bodysuit, a black denim skirt, and then these. So these were like the showcase or the staple of my look and then my like top was covered with the bodysuit so it was basically just a focus on the legs. I just feel like these are really fun to wear when you're dressed really basic for the fall. By basic I don't mean like boring, I mean just like in basics, right? Like a black top, bodysuit, long sleeve, black jeans, 
and then you can throw over a really fun puffer like a black puffer a long puffer and then you can have these um, these are really great shoe and then obviously you can transition these into the springtime and the summertime as well this top I'm wearing right now or this dress is like a uh, like a lingerie style dress it's in a peach color this is, one of my, this is one of my favorite colors i love these types of colors for like evening wear i just find that it's like so like warm like blush and nude tones all my makeup is like blush tone today i just like love those tones i know a lot of people do it's just so soothing to the eye and aesthetically pleasing this goes really long i would probably belt this um and then wear it like a wear like a boot with it or i could dress it down with like a gym shoe so that was that i hope you guys enjoyed this haul i'm so glad i could show you guys all the new items i got that i'll be wearing um and posting on instagram in the near future you can see coco right there she's literally like relaxing um and i'm really excited i could show you guys the new carol Levine drop literally like right as it's out like as you're watching it it is out so if you liked any of the pieces i showed you not only from the new in but from her line i really suggest you shop it because it will sell out really quickly in general things sell out really quickly on nasty gal so I suggest that you shop everything. I'll put everything in the description, all the links to make easy, and I'll put the sizes, uh, even though I mentioned them in case you just wanted a reference. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. I love you guys so much. If you want to stick around, be sure to subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video.